Thank you, Dan. And first of all, I want to say how many of you weren't alive the last time the Gazette won a poll? Michael Benson. No, it's actually true. Okay. <laughs> Okay, we did find out something yesterday when the announcement was made. We found out Michael cannot pop a, ca a champagne bottle. <laughs> he ended up injuring Barb in the process. <laughs> uh, and Barb is suffering today because of, of Michael's celebration. We did find that Dave could pop one in his excitement. You saw it on page one today. And there's also we're hoping we damage. We're the hoping <laughs> we're damaged somewhere up there in the ceiling. Tile three. Uh -huh. Tile three. Yeah. We got it. Tile three. Yeah. We got it. Okay. So we can install a plaque like we did in 1990 at the old building when Dave Curtin wanted uh, a Pulitzer in teacher writing. And believe me, today is historic. Um, we're a part of history today, a part of journalistic history, um, and we're so thankful that another Pulitzer Prize winner could be here in our midst today as well, Bob Jackson. <laughs> you know, uh, Dave, Joanna, and I were talking today about this project and how much passion was put into it and how many hours and hours and hours of fussing back and forth, but passion went into it. I see Stephanie, uh, how many hours she put into it with passion, and Dina, how many hours she put into it as well, and how many hours people toiled to make this project. And usually the ones that are awarded are the ones that are the most difficult to do. And that's why in that room of Pulitzer judges, they decided to honor this newspaper in middle America because they knew how difficult this project was to do, how much time Chris Hickerson put into it, into the web page, how much time Dave put into it to get it to the point that Joanna could start reading it, and how much time Michael put into it as well. Truly a historic moment yesterday but it took hours and hours of passion and work to become reality. So today we honor that commitment to journalistic excellence. We honor this company for what it's done and what it represents to all newspapers our size, all news organizations are of our size in this country. As an editor told me, as I said last night, a respected editor wrote to me that the Gazette is now an inspiration to all of American journalism in 2014. So give yourself applause. If you have a quick presentation, um, I want to present, or we, thanks to Catherine and Dan, uh, we want to present the following pages of today. We thought Dave, Joanna, and Michael had so much fun in <laughs> celebrating that we felt like they needed to take something home with them uh, in, in, as a small token of how we say thank you for what you did and how happy you look. <laughs> <laughs> I was pretty happy. <laughs> the first, Michael. start tearing up again. Where's Joanna? <laughs> By the way, there's a picture. It's all over the country now. Mark's picture of Barry hugging a cheerful <laughs> Joanna. It's, it's going to live in infamy. Well, Joanna, okay. there's like all the marked up newspapers behind it. It's like <laughs> such a great like, newspaper moment. <laughs> Only there was Barry audio with me. <laughs> <laughs> you, Congratulations.
I can't say anything that the award didn't say. I mean, this recognition is bigger than I probably even realized. Uh, but I do need to say, you know, thank you to all of you who um, carry water for me while I'm off trying to get data that doesn't turn out or, or tracking down soldiers that are hard to find and things like that. Um, uh, I deeply appreciate it and, and it probably sounds trite, but it is absolutely true that that this is a award for all of us and, and I couldn't have done it without everybody here. Uh, however, there are special people here that need additional thank yous. Mostly Joanna, who is fantastic. <laughs> and the intern, the intern. <laughs> Um, who was also like, so I'm not, most people don't like me very much, including sources, but they like Michael. And so I actually get a lot of like reporting done because Michael comes along. Um, <laughs> so for, for fighting for this story when I, I think, honestly, the Anschutz were like, what the heck's going on down there? What did we actually buy? <laughs> and, uh, so I, I appreciate that. Um, and anyway, thank you, all of you. This is fabulous. It's fabulous. Let us celebrate all week. <laughs> <laughs>